Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's bombshell statement that they were quitting as senior working royals sent shockwaves through the royal family. In early 2020, the couple revealed they would be stepping back from their roles in order to become financially independent. It is understood that Meghan and Harry didn't consult any of their relatives before making their announcement on Instagram. And Harry was later summoned to a crisis meeting at Sandringham with the Queen, Prince Charles and Prince William in what became known as the Sandringham Summit. And according to a new book, the Queen's beloved late husband Prince Philip had an indignant response when he learned about Harry and Meghan's plans. In his new book simply titled, The Queen, royal author Andrew Morton, best known for his 1992 biography of Princess Diana, writes Philip said, What the hell are they playing at? He explains, though increasingly incapacitated, Prince Philip's indignant and mystified response summed up the feelings of many inside and outside the institution. What the hell are they playing at? Love the royals. Sign up for the Mirror's daily newsletter to get all the latest news on the Queen, Charles, Kate, Wills, Meghan, Harry and the rest of the firm. Click here to sign up. The idea of a royal not wanting to be a royal anymore nor willing to accept the Queen's authority without question was simply incomprehensible, particularly to a man who had sacrificed his whole life in supporting the Queen and upholding the monarchy. Since quitting their roles, Harry and Meghan have moved to the U.S. where they have signed several big money deals with the likes of Netflix and Spotify. However, they have confirmed they will return to the UK next month to take part in the Queen's Platinum Jubilee celebrations. But there will be no place for them or their children on the Buckingham Palace balcony at Trooping the Colour. As the Queen has limited balcony appearances to working royals only, the monarch's decision to only include royals carrying out official public duties was taken after careful consideration, Buckingham Palace said. On June 2nd, Trooping the Colour, the Sovereign's official birthday parade, will kickstart the four days of Jubilee festivities, with 18 members of the royal family set to gather on the famous frontage, with the Queen looking forward the weekend of celebrations. A palace spokesman said, after careful consideration, the Queen has decided this year's traditional Trooping the Colour balcony appearance on Thursday, June 2nd will be limited to Her Majesty and those members of the royal family who are currently undertaking official public duties on behalf of the Queen. The Queen by Andrew Morton, published by Michael O'Mara, is available on May 24th.